today we are going to make a meditation jar, which is this right here. And mine is still warm, so it is settling a little fast. But yes, we're making one of these here. So if you don't know what a meditation jar is, it is just something to help you focus on when you're doing your prayer meditation. And prayer meditation is good because we're in a world where we are constantly looking for a pause, uh, meaning a time period where the chatter stops in your brain, where you're not thinking about what you have to do tomorrow, what you did yesterday, what your boss said, what the lady said to you at the store, what you should have said back, um, what you should have done in 99, like all this stuff is going on in your head. and. We are looking for ways to cope with that or to stop the chatter, to just get a second to breathe and just be. So uh, when you don't meditate or find a healthy alternative to help you with the chatter, we use bad alternatives, which can be overeating or undereating, uh, alcohol, drugs, over sexing, spending plenty of money just to make you feel good because you bought stuff. We find other things to create that pause, to create those moments that make us feel good. So we want to replace those behaviors with things like prayer and meditation. So again, with the grass, if you hear the barn boards, they're always cutting grass. Anyways, <laughs> um, for most people, they don't meditate because they say they don't know how or they say they keep thinking of things, but meditation is not really trying to stop the thoughts, it's just trying to slow them down or just recognizing how much is really going on like we're just oblivious and we just think we're all okay when really we're going through all these things so using something like a meditation jar will help you have something to stare at and focus at so you can just let the thoughts drift away um so it doesn't take much to make a meditation jar so i'm going to uh show you how to do that uh it does work best if you use fine glitter, I decided not to because I wanted mine to look more like the ocean and sand. So my glitter pieces are a little bigger. It also um, will take longer to settle if it's cool. Mine is still warm. And if you use fine glitter. But we will get into how to make this. Stay tuned. Alright guys, so to make our meditation jar, what you will need is a mason jar with the lid. You also need glitter. I have two kinds. So I have some teal turquoise uh, glitter that also has a little bit of light blue in it, as well as some gold stars. I have clear glue. Hot water, we may need a little more than this, but I have more on the stove. Um, something to stir it up with, and optional, some super glue to put around the edge for when you put your lid on to just ensure that it does not leak. So what you want to do first, put your glue, put your glue in jar. And the glue just helps the glitter float around slowly as opposed to just settling quickly to the bottom. Make sure the glue is dispersed. 